best times of my life. <laughs> Welcome back to another daily vlog. Happy Sunday. Feeling a little bit better. The eye swelling has gone down. Me and Lou were just reminiscing about the time that we were in the mall and Lou had to take a huge gnarly diarrhea poop. <laughs> and these people came in while he was doing it and the smell was so rancid. Well, I've ripped a huge loud fart too. And they're like, oh God damn. They were, it was so funny. And then I was on the outside waiting for him to come out and I was texting him. And as the people walked out, they were still rambling on about his poop. It, it was funny too, cause they were black people and they just don't understand. Like, it is so funny. Cause you could just tell and I laughed. I was like, man, them poor guys. <laughs> They were going off and I was just laughing. Yeah, they didn't know that she was with me and they're out there complaining to each other to, you know, like where she could hear it obviously. And then when I come out, them dudes gave me the look of death. <laughs> like, I thought they were gonna kick my ass. Elle and I just got done exploring a cemetery. We had plans to go to the chef's restaurant and eat and look at a wrecked car that his kid wrecked again. Again. But we couldn't find the car and he was too slam packed. So we're going to try Texas Roadhouse. They just added one in our area. Never been, we're gonna give you a review. Well, grave, we don't explore graveyards, but this one was one I remember as a kid. There's supposed to be, well, there was Confederate soldiers there from 1800s buried, and I was gonna go check out the dates, but some asshole went in and destroyed all the stones, and most of them are gone, so. We were also exploring a road that him and his brother used to have a shop on. Meanwhile, to find out, the shop's gone, the houses are gone, it was gone. Yeah, the driveway that the shop was on, the property, is a road now. It's like, this is supposed to be a driveway, but it's a road with houses on both sides of it, so. That's what 30 years of change gets you. Yeah, ain't been down there in almost 30 years. That's wild. New houses they built are already so old they're rotting. That's crazy. You can imagine what my insides look like. Texas Roadhouse, here we come. Yeah. Damn, I'm missing out. Before we go, that tomahawk. We were 15 minutes early for Texas Roadhouse. The line was crazy long. There were 50 people in line and the doors weren't even open. We were sweating our balls off outside. That place is slammed. We spent an hour in there. The steak was absolutely fantastic. Tender, great flavor. Everything was good. Their yeah. sides were good. The Food potatoes were good. Yeah. Better than Longhorns. And cheaper. Cheaper than Longhorns and way better food than Longhorns. That's shocking. Which I didn't think was possible because Longhorns is pretty damn good. And not bad on price, but this place is even is better. Is this my turn? Yes. Now we're going to Old Time Pottery just to look around for a minute. Man, this smells like potpourri panty pussy juice in this place. <laughs> potpourri panty pussy juice. That's the title of the video. Yeah, summer's Eve, that not so fresh feeling or something. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of smells like in here. That's horrible. Happy Monday. I'm filling out birthday cards. Let me show you this. Elle's birthday is 9-1. Dad's birthday is 9-2. Mom's birthday is 9-5. This is what I have to keep up with, and I have no gifts for anyone. I don't know what I'm going to do. I better get on it because it's the 28th. So I still got a little bit of time. Mom and I are reviewing the new pimento honey glazed chicken sandwich from Chick-fil-A. Oh. Me and Lou gave mom and dad the couch over there. And we so, have a full living room of couch. Right. Everybody's welcome. <laughs> All right. Looks tasty. Let's take a bite. Right. it. It's really good. Is it? No disappointment. Excellent. Very good. Got to get you some. Gotta get you some. Ooh, gotta get you some. No. I thought I made a turnaround with the sickness, and I guess I have not because I felt good for one day, and then I woke up yesterday. I have been so dizzy; it's like my equilibrium's off. 
I've been nauseous, my stomach hurts, headache, thought I had COVID, took another test, it's fucking negative. I don't know what's going on with me. All day today, any food that I put in my body, my stomach just fucking aches and it's like I have the stomach virus. I'm not pooping everywhere and I'm not throwing up. So I don't know, Lou says I need probiotics. I might try that. But right now I am making Lou chicken breasts and mashed potatoes. He's working really hard in the shop, wet sanding the car, getting ready to clean up and paint. And yeah.